Hello everybody, my name is Robert Randolph. We are Robert Randolph and the Family Band. You can follow us on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, at RRTFB. Uh, my music is, uh, is a mixture of blues, a mixture of gospel, a mixture of rock and roll, roots music. Uh, some of my favorite musicians, uh, first of all, my favorite guitarist is Stevie Ray Vaughan. He is the best guitar player of all time, I think. I think it's Stevie Ray Vaughan than everybody else. <laughs> Although, but Hendrix is like the god, you know, but it's Stevie Ray. But um, so many other great musical influences. I have Muddy Waters, Albert King, um, uh, Zeppelin, Stones, uh, Albert King, so many great others. So, um, you know, I love playing the blues. I love, I love how the blues relates to so many uh, other different genres. So out of the blues uh, came rock and roll. And everybody always wants to make rock and roll a much bigger term than the blues. But the blues is home, and home is always bigger. Well, for me, gospel was first, but gospel and blues are really, see, when I, see, everybody, really, gospel and the blues is very similar. Everything about it is similar. It's just the messages. One is the gospel, the good word, and the blues is like, tell about all your bad stuff, you know, tell about all of your down problems, and that's what the blues is, because being blue, you know, brings out that inner person. You know, when you, it's funny because, you know, gospel is the other side and the blues brings out the other side. So the mixture of two, if you're comfortable in your own skin, you can do both. <laughs> two great music artists. Bill Withers, one of the great songwriters of our day. Um, and of course, Sly and the Family Stone is, I rank them as my third favorite musical influence. Third favorite, yes. S Stevie Ray Vaughan. Stevie Wonder. Sly and the Family Stone. Yes, those are my three, three favorite music influences. I think out of those three, you can, hear, you can hear it in a lot of my songs. I mean, we got a new record coming out, and it's funny that I said that because it's really a mixture of those three sounds. Yes, it really is. Huh? No, I just noticed it just now. I just noticed it just now that it's not intentional, you know, because it's weird. It's a weird thing that I was able to notice those three influences, Stevie Ray, uh, Stevie Wonder, Sly and the Family Song, and my new record. So everybody, get it out there. It's going to be great. You'll love it. A lot of great songs. We'll see you. We were here today down in Holland in the Netherlands, deep down somewhere close to Amsterdam in Grolo, Holland. Did I say that right? Grolo, Holland. Grolo, Holland. Lap Steel was played by a lot of blues guys, you know, um, which goes back to the old Hawaiian instrument. But the pedal steel for me in my church 
If you look up sacredsteel.com, you'll see the history of where I came from, which is similar to the Buena Vista Social Club story to where this long musical history goes back to the early 1900s of African Americans playing lap steel and pedal steel guitar in church. So if you research a lot of that, then you'll be, you'll see. Keep the blues alive, keep the music alive, and slide your guitars away, baby. Thank you so very much. We are Robert Randolph and the Family Band. We are Robert Randolph and the Family Band. May God bless you.